Okay, so our first error right out of the gate as we try to build uh, for the JFLTE XX, the International Samsung Galaxy S4, this says, hey, this uh, libtime genoff.so.talk is needed and it, there's no, it's missing and there's no known rule to make it. So just talking in general here, the best thing you can do if you find an error and you don't know what to do about it is to grab the error, punch it into a search bar, and see if someone else has had that problem because most likely someone else has seen the same issue and then you'll probably find some answers. Uh, in this case, when we look at the problem, it's supposed to get this uh, this uh, file, this libtimegenoff.so.talk and what we see here in our lineage um, repository, when we go to the vendor files, we should have vendor files for the Samsung devices and we actually don't. And so when we downloaded all those things, when it was uh, looking in our repo local manifest, which we'll open up right here because we're going to add something to it, we see that it doesn't download anything for the vendor files for that JFLTEXX. So it's expecting that you've extracted the ones that you have from your very own phone. Uh, which is definitely a good way to go uh, and that would definitely work but an easier method would be to jump into a search bar and type github and type the Muppets and you'll get to their github right here these guys are great and we are looking for Samsung which I either passed or we can just search for it but if we type Samsung proprietary vendor Samsung here we go we click on that and we are looking for particularly in lineage 14.1 because we're looking at building uh, lineage 14.1 and we're looking for the device JF LTE right here so we have different JF LTE ones but in particular the JF common and JFGSM common for the Samsung Galaxy S4 devices. So we need to download this and put it where it needs to go. The easiest way to do that is to say click on proprietary vendor Samsung. We just copy this and we're going to open up our local manifest we'll just paste that in there for a second because we're going to use it and we're going to add another project to our list so we're going to copy this line here and put it in there and so notice that you don't have to put none of these put this HTTPS github.com because those are already written by saying I want to remote it from github so we delete all of this and here's what we're left with the Muppets proprietary vendor Samsung. So we'll cut that, we'll paste it right in there, and then where's it going to go? It's going to go in the vendor Samsung folder. So we say vendor, and then we say Samsung. And what we do need to make sure that we're doing is we're getting the proper uh, version of that and how do we do that well let's take a look real quick in here in our manifest file if we open that with gedit go back up to the top here So default revision is trying to get the division cm-14.1 from GitHub. <clears throat> so that's important because it's going to be looking for the cm-14.1 and in this case we do have cm-14.1 so it's going to grab that version of it. So it's saying in here that the default unless you specify something else it's going to try to grab this and I I think we can look in here. Find branch. No, 
no one has specified a different branch in here, but you can specify a different branch if you if you want uh, inside of there. But so you just want to make sure that uh, you've got this added to your list. We're going to save that, and now that we've saved that, if we reload this again, it's going to download that and uh, and going to have that file available for us. So we can run repo sync and it's going to grab that file for us and then we can start our build again.